Hello and welcome to the book club. Okay. Welcome Woo! to the book club. <laughs> Merry, Merry Christmas. Christmas. Of course, my name is Helen King. I'm Tyon Nisola. I'm Hannah Bonsi. And this is where we look at books written by a man of God, yes. Reverend Dr. Chris Oyakilome. And of course, Christmas, we're not doing anything far out. We're still looking at an amazing book that has blessed lives around the world. Yes. And this book is The, the Rhapsody, Rhapsody of Realities. Realities. Yes. yes, we are going to be talking about angels at Christmas. Yes. You know, in the book club, we are very evangelical. Yes, we, really we preach, we win souls, we do code rabba, we know what it means. <laughs> Absolutely, and you know, and if you have watched some of our, you know, previous episodes, you can testify to that. We are always yes. out and about preaching the gospel, and what better way to do it during this period of time? Yes. When people are, you know, receptive to receiving the gospel, yes. there's so much excitement, so much happiness going on. So take advantage of it today and make sure you distribute the Rhapsody of Realities. That's the best gift you can give someone. Yes. yes. It's the Christmas season. It's the season to be happy, to be merry, to be joyful, to spend time with your family. You know, it's that season of the year where everybody wants to go home to go spend time with their loved ones, you know. <laughs> it's a season where there is so much food that you have to give out as well. Yes. But what is the purpose? What's the mandate of this season? What is the reason behind this season? Now we're going to be watching an excerpt from our man of God, Pastor Chris Oyakilome, where he shares with us the mandate, the purpose of Christmas. Watch this. Our various editions of Rhapsody of Realities. Rhapsody of Realities for early readers. December edition is available. Rhapsody of Realities for kids, volume 127. It's available now. And by the title you can tell is also December edition, the Savior is born. Then we've got Rhapsody of Realities for our teenagers, Rhapsody of Realities Tivo. December edition is available right now, so you can get a copy for the teenagers. And then Rhapsody of Realities for Should I see the adults or the elderly? So you got the December edition available. Make sure to get your copy today. And you know, these materials you can give as gifts. Package them along with your December gifts. Don't forget, we're in a season of gifting. So, make sure that you've got a rhapsody of the different editions, depending, of course, on who you're sending to. Put these in your hampers as you send them. Yeah. You'll be amazed at the things that will happen. You'll be surprised. Be surprised. These are special materials. Special materials. Angels at Christmas. Angels at Christmas. When are they flying? Yes, the angels have started flying in 7,858 languages. Wow. When are, are they flying? Are they flying? <laughs> angels at Christmas. We'll soon be telling you when. We'll Just stay tuned. They're already flying. They're already flying. <laughs> they're already flying. <laughs> You know. Oh, yes, we have more to bring you on that. You know, the man of God asks, when are they flying? Just keep yes. on watching the book club. In case you see that for the first time, you get all that information as well. So you can give out those special Christmas gifts yes. either as, you know, the value pack. Or the deluxe pack. Or the Angel Super Deluxe Pack. Yes. You have yeah. options. You have options yeah. to take. And our man of God, Pastor Christmas said, even as you prepare to give out those mm -hmm. bags, you know, sometimes you go to shops, people prepare Christmas hampers, hampers yeah. Christmas baskets, yeah. Christmas boxes, you know, but you give out Christmas Rhapsody mm -hmm. packs. Yeah. Yes. You know, so you can choose out of these packs. You know, the details will be showing on your screen. If you want more information, we'll tell mm -hmm. you shortly how to get that. But get on. 
as you send an angel at Christmas. Yes. Absolutely. Flying soon. <laughs> <laughs> like your angels are flying soon. Mine are already flying. Right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, out now, and about. Now we're going to take you know, a quick look at, you know, some of the beautiful messages that our dear man of God, Reverend Dr. Chris, has written for us during Christmas time. Yes. And it's very important that you know the reason why. Of course, you're the reason for the season. Yes. But you need to really have the understanding as to why Christ was born. So we're going to take yeah. a look at this first excerpt. Mm. And this is the Rhapsody of Realities. It was written on the 25th of December, 2020. And the title, it says Christmas every day. Every Christmas day. Every day. Every day. I, I like that. I like that one. Absolutely. I like every that. day. Every day. So the topic is saying, celebrating the living and incarnate word. Now, the scripture, it says, for we are God's own handiwork, his workmanship, recreated in Christ Jesus, born anew, living the good life which he prearranged and made ready for us to live. Mm. That's in Ephesians chapter 2, Verse 10, that's the Amplified Classic. Now, let's take a look at what Pastor says. Pastor said, Jesus was born that men may have and live the good life. Amen. As our theme scripture reveals, in John chapter 10, verse 10, the Amplified Classic, he said, he said I came that they may have and enjoy life and have it yeah. in abundance to the full. Till, Till it, it overflows. overflows. Hallelujah. Oh, glory to Praise God. God. <laughs> so now you understand why. Jesus was born. He came yes. to so have yes. life, eternal life and have it to the full. Glory to God. Hallelujah. 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 Now, let's take a quick look at the confessions. It's very important that you don't just read the Rhapsody, but you have to say it. You have to say the confessions. Mm -hmm. Praise God. So I'm just going to say it and then you can repeat it after me. So we'll take the confession. Blessed Jesus. Blessed, Blessed Jesus. Jesus. How great and glorious you are. How, How great, great and glorious, glorious you are. are. Savior of the world. Savior of the world. world. Joy of heaven. Joy of heaven. And hope of all mankind. And hope of all, all mankind. mankind. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you. For giving me eternal life. For giving me eternal life. Thank you. Thank you. For making me the living house. For, For making me the living house. Of the living God. Of the living God. Manifesting your glory. Manifesting your, your glory, glory and righteousness and righteousness in, in, in and through me everywhere and through me everywhere you're the only wise and true god you're, you're the, the only wise and true god. god your name be praised your, your name be praised and adored and, and adored, adored now and forever now and forever amen amen Glory. beautiful Glory to God. You can't say these words and remain the same. Not at all. Not at oh, all. Thank you, Lord. We have God. more. We have more. There is more to come, you know. This this is just giving me so much memory, <laughs> you know. The December 25th of every single year, pastors yeah. brought us a message, yes. a message for us. Now we're looking at the 25th of December, 2021. Mm. And pastor says to us here, Jesus of Nazareth, the only, only true God. God. Yes. Now the scriptural reading is from John chapter 6, verse 69 and it says and we believe and assure that thou art the christ the son of the living god mm. hallelujah. hallelujah and pastor goes on here to share with us it says when jesus walked the earth he was god in the flesh all of divinity was tabernacled in him he was the living body of the almighty god he was god alive mm. walking and talking in a man's body, praise oh, God. Yeah. Read what Colossians chapter one, verse 19 in the Amplified Classic says about him. For it has pleased the Father that all the divinity, full, the divine fullness, the sum and total of the divine perfection, power and attributes should dwell in him permanently. Hallelujah. Praise God. Hallelujah. That is the Jesus we know. That's yes. the Jesus of Nazareth, the true, the only true God. Now let's go to the confession where we, you know, we have to stir it up in our spirits as well. <laughs> just read it after me. You can see it on screen, but just say it after me. I am a success. I'm, I'm a success. success. I live in health. I live in health. Because because the life of God, the life of God is in me. Is in me. The strength of God, the strength of God is in me. Is in me. No disease, no, no disease, no infirmity, no infirmity can thrive in my body. Can thrive in my body because my body, because my body is the temple of the Holy Spirit. Is the temple of the Holy Spirit. I'm living. I'm living the good life. The good life prearranged for me. Prearranged for me. Before 
before the foundation of the world. Before the foundation of the world. I live in victory. I live in the victory. Glory. Glory. Dominion. Dominion. And righteousness of Christ. And righteousness of Christ. It is Christmas every day. It is Christmas every day. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. So as you can see twice, you know, from 2020, 2021, and I'm sure previous years before that, because the Rasta of Realities has been in print more than 20 years now. So I'm sure all these many years we've been seeing, you know, a man of God, Pastor Chris, telling us yes. that Christmas is every, every day. day. The divine life of mm. Jesus Christ in us is not just a mere man, in us, walking in us, living in us. Every, Every day. day. We have that total package. So now let's move on to 2022 because we're yes. in 2022. And Pastor yeah. says, divine love with the, the Father. Father. Oh, oh, hallelujah. Praise yeah. God. Say, some people might say, I just want someone to love me. But you have divine, <laughs> divine love, love with the, the Father. Father. Wow. It says, greater love hath no man than this, yes. that a man laid down his life for his friends. John 15, 13. It says, Christmas is the celebration of the birth of Jesus Christ. He was born to fulfill the will of the Father. He was God's love manifested to, to us. us. He was God's sacrificial lamb to die and pay the price for the salvation of the world, to bring men into divine fellowship with the Father. Hallelujah. So there was a purpose for what he did. Yes. Somebody says, Jesus died for you. So, well, I didn't ask him to. Or Jesus died for you. Well, th what does that have to do with me today? You know, that is the purpose. Mm. It says to bring us into divine fellowship divine with fellowship the Father. With the Father. Now let's go. I want to quickly read this before I read the confession. It says, he saved us with his own love and gave his life for us mm -hmm. so we could experience the Father's love mm -hmm. through mm -hmm. fellowship. Mm -hmm. Now we can better understand the angel's message to the shepherds in Luke 2, 11 to 14. For unto us, unto you, is born this day in the city of David yes. a Savior, which is Christ the Lord. And this shall be a sign unto you. Ye shall find the babe wrapped in swaddling clothes, lying in a manger. And suddenly there was with the angel a multitude of heavenly hosts praising God and saying, Glory to God in the highest and on earth, good peace goodwill toward men. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. So you see, do not Hallelujah. fill your Christmas with just movies about Santa Claus or movies about the Grinch or movies about, you know, Ebenezer Scrooge. <laughs> Who knows? It's not about that. Don't just fill your, your children's time with animations of things that are not talking about this. This is the true story of Christmas. How unto us a child in the city of David, a savior was born. Maybe Make sure they hear this story every Christmas so that they understand that God's love was manifested in flesh, came to die for us. It says, and this shall be a sign unto you. Then it tells us the story of what actually happened in Christmas. So the Christmas movies they should be watching is this, about how the angels came and announced that a babe was born in a manger from a virgin because God was manifested in flesh and how they found him and how the angels sang glory to God. Yeah, yeah. So right. your Christmas should be full of singing worship and praise to God, not just mm. jingle bells, jingle <laughs> bells, jingle all the way. It's not just about that. It's also about singing glory, glory to, to God, God in the God highest and on highest. earth, peace, goodwill yeah. toward yeah. men. Do you see powerful message? Yes. So now let's go ahead and make the declarations of the confession together. Dear Father, Dear Father, Dear Father you, are awesome, you are awesome, glorious, glorious righteous, righteous, holy, holy, holy just, just, and true. And true. I, love you, I love you, Lord. Lord. You, are gracious you are gracious and ever kind. And ever kind. Thank, you Thank you for the honor, for the honor of being in fellowship of being in fellowship with you with you to experience your divine love to experience your divine love in ways beyond human comprehension in ways beyond human comprehension and for making me and for making me an expression an expression of you of you and of your love and of your love amen, amen. hallelujah 
God. Glory to God. Hallelujah. So when you read the Rhapsody of Realities like this, I know a man of God, Pastor Chris, this year taught us how to read the Rhapsody of Realities out loud. Yes. He said, read it out. You get so stirred up in your yes. spirit and so excited. It's beautiful. There's nothing like it. Yes. Absolutely. Absolutely. An expression of his love. Mm -hmm. You know, when you read words like this, you're moved to even share it as well. Yes. That yes. You don't want to be the only person to feel like the expression of God's love. Mm -hmm. You're an expression of his love, so make the next person an expression as well. Yes. So the next person is an expression as well. Yes. Before we all know it, we are all oh. basking. Kala in the love of God, which Hallelujah. is beautiful. Hallelujah. Oh, the love of God is just so amazing. How can you read this message and <laughs> want to keep it to yourself? No. It's not possible. Like, you know, we said earlier on, I mean, Christmas is a time whereby, you know, um, there's so much happiness going on. We have so many people who are receptive to hearing yes. the gospel. And you cannot go mm. without telling someone about mm. Jesus. Yes. I am so sad listening to this words. Imagine. Yes. If so, so, and it's very possible that there's someone out there who's never heard of the gospel. Yes. yes. There's exactly. someone out there who's never heard of Jesus. There's someone out there who's, who doesn't, yes. who's never heard the word Jesus loves you. Yes. You, yes. you, you will be surprised. Yes. Yes. There's, there are people out there when you, say, when you tell them about Jesus, they'll be like, who, who's, who's Jesus? Jesus? Wow. So you cannot afford to just enjoy all of this to yourself. You have mm -hmm. to send your angels, like Pastor said earlier on. Yes. Are your angels flying? You need to send them to send fly. Them fly. <laughs> to fly. They, they need to fly. They are waiting. Imagine the angels are just there. They're waiting. They're they need waiting. they need that command from you. You need to they send need to them fly. to fly. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You know, speaking about Christmas, you know, Tayo at the beginning of the program was talking about how people love to go home, spend yes. time with their family yes. members, receive gifts. You know, Love World UK has given gifts Whoa. to, you know, staff. Okay. Okay. Merry Christmas gifts. We're enjoying ourselves. So I just thought we might as well share some gifts here because we also give gifts out. Yeah. I'm sure their children are expecting their parents to buy them the latest this yes. and the latest that and the latest things. Mm -hmm. But we just thought I might as well, you know, share gifts out on the book share club. Gifts. Okay, okay. okay. All right. So okay. let's um, let's <laughs> unbox some of these boxes. You know. <laughs> It's all fun and good Thank here. You. Okay, yeah. I get to pick. <laughs> <Okay>. um. <laughs> you know, love your neighbor as, as yourself. As yourself. So I love my I love myself a lot. You know. Mm. Wow. Glory. Glory. Uh, 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 mm. Mm. I am very grateful, but um, uh. Jesus Christ died for me. In Christmas, you Not can't refuse receive. gifts. You Not take you, <laughs> you take <laughs> what you've been given. <laughs> in Christmas, you can't receive. Anyway, the power of the seed is not in the sight. Thank mm -hmm. you. Oh, mm -hmm. it, you fine. could just find the, your a full house. The whole world could be in <laughs> exactly. that place. Oh, so, okay. Ooh, okay. Okay, I got my biscuits. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Got my sweets. I like, I like my biscuits right there. Nicely wrapped. Come on, come on. I'm not, sure wrapped. Like okay. I'm not come sharing. On. Nicely wrapped. Share, right. share. I got bad chocolate. You have to share the love. You see, you have to share. So when you get your gifts, open it up. See if it's something you can share with the next person. And so you are taking my. I thought you were sharing. <laughs> okay. To share, not okay, to so, take. So funny enough, he doesn't mm. want to share, but he mm -hmm. wants to take. Mm -hmm. So we're just reminding people because <laughs> there are times when sometimes you open up that special gift and you're yeah. like, is this it? Is this it? Is this it? <laughs> you, you bought me socks? Really? Like, I don't have enough socks in my oh, life. Yeah. You know, so don't be disappointed with what you get. Remember yeah. to be full of thanksgiving. Yes. You know, thank Thank you. It's the same for be Thanksgiving, grateful. right? Yes. yes. We're still in December. Absolutely. Yes. Yes. You have, still have to, about you have to be about thankful and you have to be grateful. I remember it's so funny that like you just mentioned, you know, someone received a gift of, you know, a socks. I remember last year my housemate. <laughs> <laughs> it was a, a nice, you know, well, well, <laughs> well wrapped under the Christmas tree. <laughs> Took and it was a candle and a pair of socks. Okay. <laughs> well, that's lovely. Very British. Very British. Very lovely. <laughs> We love but it, you know, of like course. Yeah, very certain kind of so it was, Maybe they're it was trying to nice. say something. Yeah. <laughs> we want to say something. It's still, it's, it was still smelling nice. Oh, yeah, so it's okay. That's it's nice. Yeah. Some people like, you know, just like, what? Why? Don't you know who I am? I need something else. No, be but not like that. Be grateful. Yeah, be thankful. Beautiful, isn't Beautiful. it? Beautiful. Yeah. But you see, the greatest gift of all kind is yes. salvation. Yes. Is our Lord yes. Jesus Christ, yes. you know. And right now, we're going to give you the opportunity. If you have not received Jesus Christ as the Lord and Savior of your life, what are you waiting for? It's Christmas. It is. And it's Christmas every day. Every so you day. should give your life to Jesus Christ right now because yeah. we've shared with you the message, the mm. word of how his love he, he did everything is all a love story the, the whole story of the lord jesus christ is a love story mm -hmm. and he had you in mind 
The Bible explains to us that if it was just you on earth, Jesus will have still done the same thing. Yes. He will have still gone to the cross. He will have still died for your sin mm -hmm. and for your sake, for you to have eternal life with him yeah. and for you not to perish. Because every death of a sinner does not gladden God. It pains his heart and he does not like it. So mm -hmm. he is giving you this opportunity right now. So if you would like to give your life to Jesus Christ, wherever you are, on the surface of the earth, whatever time it is, mm -hmm. just say this prayer with me. Oh, Lord God. I believe with all my heart in Jesus Christ, son of the living God. I believe he died for me and God raised him from the dead. I believe he's alive today. I confess with my mouth that Jesus Christ is the Lord of my life. From this day, through his name, I have eternal life. I am born again. Thank you. Lord, for saving my soul. Oh, I am now a child of God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise God. That's the best decision that you have made mm -hmm. during this time. Congratulations. You are now a child of God. God. Welcome to God's beautiful and wonderful family. There's room for everyone. Now, if you just said that prayer, can you send us your name, your details, your home address, you know, whatever you want to do, just, we just want to hear from <laughs> you and we would love to send you some beautiful message. We'll have to send you angels at Christmas. We would specially package it and we will post it to you. So if you just said that prayer, you are now a child of God. Congratulations. Congratulations. Welcome to God's beautiful family. Now you go on to do greater things. Yeah. Yes. Other people <laughs> to Christ as well. And you know, we, this season we'll be talking about gift giving giving thanks first of all to the Lord, like we read in the Rock of Realities, mm -hmm. praising the Lord and giving thanks to his name because Christmas is all about the love of God mm -hmm. make it, being made manifest to mankind. Yes. And then we talked about giving gifts and being grateful for what you do receive. But then mm -hmm. of course, the theme of all of this is giving angels at oh, Christmas, Christmas. Yes. as our man of God, Pastor Chris has said. So this is more information on, because he asks, it says, when are the angels flying? <laughs> we watched at the beginning. Yeah. This is how you can get flying if you haven't already begun to do so. Make sure you give out angels at Christmas. Watch this. Christmas season is here again. A time to celebrate the birth of our Lord Jesus Christ. It's time to be an angel and to share God's love to all. From so the merry, merry day to you and everyone. Let's reach out as we distribute rhapsody to the world. It's angels at Christmas for you and everyone. Angels at Christmas for you. today to sponsor Rhapsody of Realities around the world. You can adopt a household, adopt a street, adopt a neighborhood, adopt a city, even adopt a nation. For more information on Reach Out World, please call the numbers showing on your screen. God bless you. It's angels at Christmas for you, and everyone is angels at Christmas for you. I'm not sure, I'm not sure what key, what key you were singing on, but yeah, was, <laughs> but, you, was, but you got a point. It was key C, C for Christmas. <laughs> yeah, we were, we were dear, right there. But yeah. <laughs> Oh, Perhaps okay. you didn't get a number on the screen. You know, you can still contact us, our details on the screen. Mm -hmm. If you want to get more information about how you can send your angels flying during this period, we have more information to give to you. And remember, we have, you know, the Rhapsody of Realities is written in all the known languages yes. in the entire world. Yes. So what are you waiting for? You can't say that, oh, this is not in my language. We have it in we all the it. known languages. 
Yes. So, so get in touch. Get in touch. See, so that's what we're doing this season. We're giving out gifts to everyone. We're giving angels at Christmas and make sure that your city, you can adopt a street, you can adopt a town, yeah. you can adopt a nation, mm -hmm. you can adopt a country, as they said, and give out those wonderful value packs, mm -hmm. whether it's a super deluxe, the deluxe, the value packs, you give them out, give out angels at Christmas. The Rhapsody yeah. of Realities should be in everyone's homes this season. We can make it happen. Oh, yes. Okay? But for now, that's as much time as we've got on this episode of the Book Club. But to sign out, we're going to sing you our very special song. Yes. We wish you a <laughs> Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. One more time, we'll sing it again. But just before that, remember, we are giving out free Christmas gifts. Oh, yes. Okay? All you need to do is get to the website and fill out those details. So we're going to do the song again. And if you're yet to fill out details, you can do it right now as we're singing this for you. Okay? We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And a Happy New Year. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas from the book club. We love you. Love you. We love you. <laughs>